Well, hello, hello, and uh, welcome back to Skyrim for inevitably the last time for the uh, main story, anyway. Um, and then, like I said, I'll take a little bit of a break before I do. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon. It's a. T well, I don't know. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not. Yeah, like I said, this will be the uh, last time. Come on, we need to find out what's happening up there. Hello? Ghost? Raggy? Oh, there it is. No, we don't. We run up there. Oh, but anyway, so like I said, this will be the last time that I'll take a hiatus. My plan is to maybe do Deus Ex, just because my friend Dog Shadow said um, that I won't get Deus Ex done by the new year. Don't say that, otherwise I'll just force myself to do it. Salonki is in I speak the... And Dragon Ball. Durgan. Fuck you, Alduin. I'ma kill your Durgan. You can resurrect as many as you want, I'll kill them all. This glory stuff, yeah. Oh, did he only just get his skin back? I'm so sorry. God, oh, look at it's true. I owe you. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. I'm one of the last members. A very long time ago, the blades were dragon slayers, and we served the dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. You the just Thalmor saw. Our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War 30 years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. Nothing solid yet, but my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Well, the uh, blade side quest I'm looking at, I need to kill Parthuna. Time to pull things together. Well, I'll make another hard save before I do that. I'm not back Find out whatever that leads to and then reload and continue from there. Eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. 
Blade in the dark. Oh, holy. Oh, fucking add piss off. Diplomatic immunity. Rude. Yeah, like I said, this shouldn't take too long. Hello. Have you heard? There's been another drag. Um, Miss Urgenbone. Uh, the choppy thing is over there. Whatever you need. I may as well do this now and get the. Arrows. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit. Oh, I already have firewood. There you go. Oh! That map here. I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. Fish. <laughs> I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of attention. But they don't know you. The Thalmor Ambassador, Ellen Wynn regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the I can get you into one of those parties once you're inside the embassy you can I have a contact inside the embassy he's not his name is Malborn Wood Elf plenty of I'll get word for him to meet you in while you're doing that I'll work on meet me at the solitude stables after you've arranged things with Malborn any questions nope. Wanking Skeev. What do you need? Really? You're who's... Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. You're asking me? If you actually want to get out alive, I'd bring whatever you need to move quietly and kill quickly. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. I can even give him the skeleton key. Oh, it's a quest I can't. Can I give him the log picks? I don't think I need to, do I? I mean, I guess just in case I can give him like 100. Oh, I'm a little bit nude. Your job is to get into the party. Yep. Shut up. Oh. 
if it isn't the slayer of the Glen Moral Witches. How can I assist you? Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle? Good. But the only way you're going to get past the guard, which means you need to look the part, and not... When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until... You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus what... You can't go to a party at the Thalmor... Embassy dressed like that. I'm not gonna come go dressed like this. I guess that will have to do. You should be ready to board the carriage to the embassy. Don't worry. Just make sure. Good luck. Actually, I'll keep the skeleton key on me, won't I? Because I can't get rid of it. The only unfortunate thing is, I don't have my sneak rings and shit, but I shan't need them. Uh, a fellow late It also took my lockpicks, didn't it? <laughs> Again, doesn't matter, but... Invitation, please. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Here's my invitation. I don't have a poison Go dagger right strapped on. to my thigh. The party's already started. The Thalmor Embassy welcomes you. Everything. Welcome. I don't. And you are? Ah, yes. Please. Madam Adbat. What is it, Malborn? So sorry to interrupt. It's just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. Red? I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. What, what can I get for you, sir? Of course. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. Travel has become dangerous of late. I couldn't agree more. What does a fellow need to do to me? My friend. And none of the waiters will bring. Afraid I'll cause another scene, I suppose. You must be. But I have. And if you want to do business in Tamrio these days, well, you better get used to cozying up to the thousands. Always Ellen Wen always throws quite a part. But not every no. Who knows? A rare few are. As for honor, well, there are some luxuries even I... There's what a likely get looking... Here silly. you go, sir. Colovian brandy. Good You're day. There. Serving girl! What's your name, dear? What does a fellow need to do to... Ah, the one... If there's anything I can ever do for you... Wonderful. I can be... Is that all? <laughs> Stand back and believe me, I don't say my handiwork. I'm very... Attention, everyone. Could I have your attention, please? I have an announcement to make. Yes, what do you need? Of course. I'll be waiting by... Let's go, let's go. Before anyone notices us. I speak figuratively. Nothing could be more unlikely than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Although... Let me do the talking. So far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. We need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Follow me. Who comes, Malvern? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Savani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Come. If someone... This is 
me at the party were both dead. Good Did luck. you see those robes You're on your own this now. morning? Who are they with? More of the Emissary's Treaty Enforcers? No, they're High Mages, just in from Alinor. I guess herself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. If a dragon does show up, maybe we'll get lucky and it's... I need to be in the corner, but you guys need to piss off. Ha! I'd like to see those arrogant bastards taken down a notch. Always looking down their noses at us lowly foot slobbers. <laughs> well, we'd better get back to our rounds. I'm slacking. No, you're slacking. No, it's because I bought a, um, eating blanket last night, so... It was being delivered today, so... That's why I'm on lit. Huh? This is gonna be bullshit. Look at me, money bags. What do you mean, money bags? to run i mean accord well no according to um looking it up it's not that expensive i mean if it is then i've basically just spent money on a blanket because <laughs> like i say for, for fucking um keaton here it's like a it's like bloody uh, one pound 30 one pound 50 or whatever it is an hour that's infinitely more expensive, so... I fucking hate this. Is someone there? Huh? Ow. Why? Guess I'm just gonna do this in the fucking nude, shall I? Did I not buy the bloody upgrade that makes me silent for wearing armor? I mean, probably not. That armor weighs nothing. But because it weighs nothing, Therefore, it means...
My god. What is the point in having basically max level sneak if these bastards are just gonna look out the fucking back of their head anyway? Which is gonna be fucking annoying, isn't it? Unless for no particular reason he just fucking turns around. Oh no, because there's a guy right on the fucking door, that's why. I've spent 60 hours leveling Sneak for it to amount to fucking nothing. Because everyone can see through fucking tree lines, apparently. Like, that guy sitting on the fucking doorway can see me moving here. Piss off. See, like, this fucker can't see me. But some barren on doorway staring right through a sodding tree line. You better not come this way. Expenses you Silence! Know. Do not presume, Gisser. You are most useful, but do not presume. We have other informants who are less offensive. But no one else. It's brought you such valuable information, have they? He's talked, hasn't he? He knows where that old man is you're looking for. He told me himself. Stop, please. I don't know anything else. Don't you think I'd have told you already? Silence. You know the rules. Oh, of course. Where was he when I couldn't see that? Please, I don't know anything else. Oh, there, that's I think I'd have told you already. Silence. You know the rules. Do not speak unless spoken to. Master Rollindil will ask the questions. Let's begin again. No, for pity's you know sake. The rules. I've already told you everything. Start of the beginning. Beginning, as usual. If you persist oh, in this wait. stubbornness, I'm catching my breath. Listen up, spy. My breath. You're trapped in here, <laughs> and we I have your again? accomplice. I, I don't even know anything. Surrender immediately. There's an old man. Die. He lives in Rifton. Never mind. Silence. I'm dead already. Be as Esbon you're looking for, Slowly. but I don't know. 
He's old and seem kind of crazy. <laughs> Let's all Only know. King. And his name is... I don't know his name. He's Look, got to I've be here somewhere. I've already told you a hundred... How much am I willing to pay for Horizon Forbidden West? Just answer the questions. A fiver? Where can we find this nameless old man? Like, it really depends. Thirty pound on Amazon. I've seen him down in the ratway. Mm. Maybe he lives down there, but I don't know for sure. That will be all for now. I must say, I continue to be disappointed in your lack of cooperation. I hope next time you will do better. What else do you want from me? No, I'm 68, well, I mean... <laughs> I didn't work for Co. As I've said plenty of times playing this game, it's not my fault that the arrows come out my, from my fucking asshole. Like, here's my arrow, clearly over the edge, but it spawns from inside my own dick. It is beyond dumb. Oh, I'll take that. That was a big whiff. I didn't whiff. Bad game design doesn't mean I'm whiffing. Shit again. God might get nervous, a man approaches with his weapons. You're new around here, so get me mad. And I'll prank you. And not a little, a lot. And I'll just shoot you in the face with this damn bow. You think I give a shit about killing you? <laughs> you made it out alive, at least. Did you learn anything useful? Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about. Esbern? He's alive? I thought the Thalmor okay. must have got him years ago. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's going on with the dragons. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. Ironic, right? The old enemies assume that every calamity must be... Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. 
He'll know how to stop the dragon. Do they know where he is? Riften, eh? Probably down in the Ratway, then. You'd better get to Riften. Ask around the Ragged Flagon. Oh, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. He'll know what it means. What is it? Can I have my ship back, by the way? What is it? I want my ship back is what I want. You're new around here. And then I'll quickly go pee. What do you need? Right? Gonna go before I start on the too late now. Do you need something? Get me my and I'll prank the blacksmith. And not I'm a little five. I need a so I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go pee pee. Oh me back. <laughs> Moment. Right. Uh, why am I looking for control? I'm not controller boy. I'm a soldier boy. people looking for him don't know his name but he's paid good money for nobody to know he's down here he's holed up in the ratway warrens hardly ever leaves the place crazy old coot from what i've heard for that to stand out down here he must really be off his nut all right ratway vaults Oh, not on his knee. He needed that. I'm not Esbern. I don't know what you're talking about. Delphi? How do you... So, so you finally found her. And she led you to me. And here I am, caught like a rat in a trap. So Delphi keeps up the fight after all these years. 47. Tell me how you found me. And what you want. I shall speak to these things in the right way. No. Th this will just take a moment. 
this one always fits. There we go. Only a couple more. There we are. Come in, come in. Make yourself at home. That's better. Now we can talk. So, Delphine keeps up the fun. I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. I tried to th Haven't you figured it out yet? What more needs to happen before you all wake up and see what's going on? Aldwin has returned, just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time, who devours the souls of the dead. No one can escape his hunger. Here or in the afterlife, Alduin will devour all things, and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. Ah, I tried to tell them. They wouldn't listen. Fools. It's all come true. Yes, yes. You see, you know, but you refused. Oh, yes. It's all been foretold. The end Is it called Ragnarok? Only a drag. It seems that the gods have grown tired of us. They've left us to our fate, as the plaything of all- What? You are- Then- Then there is hope. We must go, quickly now. But give me just a moment, I must gather a few things. The cornered rat. Although we need wool. No, no. Quests. Where did I put my animal? Where are they? Where did I put that page? One moment, I know time is of the essence, but mustn't leave secrets for the Thalmor. There's one more that I must bring now. Well, I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. My gold. She's the deaf, and yet she somehow heard us fighting upstairs. Some deaf woman. The rat way vaults. I'll do wind wall. Stop doing that. Stupid fucking game. Is that? It's annoying. Stop putting me in goddamn slow mo and forcing me to miss my goddamn shot. I'm perfectly capable of whiffing myself, thank you very much. I don't need you to make me look worse. <laughs> Available. Give me more help. 
Um, well, now is the point where I can use that book to get my snack to max level. Which was if I'm going to get to level 50. I'm going to guess if you want to listen to of use the book on the two other skill trees, but I know I will just get more XP out of doing it on Thief. Thief! What is... really? He's safe? Mara's mercy, then he's safe. Come on, we have a lot to discuss. What is it? Delphine, ha. why, it's good to see you. It's been a long time. It's good to see you too, Esbern. It's been too long, old friend, too long. Well, then, you made it safe and sound. Good. Come on, I have a place we can talk. Orgnar, hold down the bar for a minute, will you? Yeah, sure. This way. Now then, I assume you know about... Oh yes, Dragonbow, indeed, yes. Oh, this changes everything, of course. There's no time to lose, so we must locate. Let me show you. I know I had it here somewhere. Esbern, what? Give me just a moment. Oh. Ah, here it is. Come. You see, right here, sky... Angels of the Dragon Gun. Ooh, it's in whatever this world's universe of Japanese is. Thanks for the book. Alduin's Wall. His location has been lost. Not lost, you see, just forgotten. The Blades Archive. This is what I've been trying to explain. It That's where we'll find You know Alduin's what he's talking wall. about? So you nope. think that thank you. I don't have any more dragon stuff, do I? No guarantee. Hello. Would you like not I'm follow me? Up. I'm a little deaf in my right ear. Are we just going to cast spy? So I don't want this bastard following me. Yep. That I don't want companions. I do want to kill the Durgan. Because I'm going to need all the arrows that I can get. Two dragons! Except that one fell through the map. Two Durgans. Ooh.
Oh, he was finding bandits. Give me my soul. How many dragon bands do I have? Six, and I have how many firewood? Oh, so I need to chop some wood. Once more, fuck it, I'll just kill these bastards whilst I'm here. They already know I'm here. All those wasted arrows. Lead on to Skyhaven Temple. No, I don't do it after this. No. Oh, this is why I don't do companions. Listen. <laughs> I did it. I have no idea what the fuck I did. I matched whatever that was. I'm assuming there's a hint somewhere. But... Wait. We should be careful here. See these symbols on the floor? Mm. Esbern's right. Look like pressure plates. Be careful. We'll cross once it's safe. It's safe now. Let's move. I think we must cross to the end.
preserved. Ah, here's the blood seal. Another of the lost the heavy rewards. No doubt treated by well, blood. Your blood. Look here. You see how the ancient blades revered even Cyrodiil? Slice. You guys gonna get your asses in here? Please. Fascinating. Original Akaviri bar reliefs. Almost entirely intact. Amazing. You can see how the Akaviri craftsmen were beginning to embrace the more flowing Nordic style. We're here for Alduin's wall, right, Esbern? Yes, of course. This running two year or nay for me. Um up ahead. I mean it's it's one of those things where I enjoyed the first game, so I should enjoy the second game. But I have to obviously be completely well, I have to be completely honest, but I think one of the main reasons I enjoyed it was because I got to the game pretty fucking late um, and it threw me onto a server where basically everyone had already built you know the main section of the highway that you can build and all I had to do was just do the tutorial to build the first section and then the rest of it was basically complete and then all I had to do was connect the little chunks going all the way down south without needing to grind or wait for other people exactly I was kind of spoiled because without that highway system, don't get me wrong, I'm not going to say the game would have been worse or anything, but the game would have been different because I would have needed to go up cliffs, down cliffs, whatever. And obviously whenever, whenever I needed to deliver obviously a lot of um, parcels, I could just I could just put them all on top of me, get on the highway, straight down, straight to each of the bases, and nothing would ever matter, nothing would touch me. So I think obviously in some ways I was missing out on the gameplay elements of actually needing to be careful of, you know, the rain and the ghosts or whatever they were called. Whereas I could just drive straight through that and not give a shit because as far as I was aware they don't ever spawn on those roads, so... And then especially right at the end of the game, you know, when you're all the way down south and you've got to make your way all the way up north, again, having that built all the way and then also i think at some point you know the main river i think i tried to build something across there as well at one point you know where the tiny rocks were and so like the ladders and stuff were already there so i was traversing up you go across there you're on the road and then you're straight up so yeah i, I think in some ways i like you say i was spoiled playing it i mean i still enjoyed it but there's, but there's the potentiality that if I did say get Death Stranding day one, I don't think I would, but if I did, there is obviously that entire plausibility that I might not enjoy it because, I mean, obviously it depends. If, um, you hope it's like that round two, yeah, well. Um, but again, I guess it just kind of depends because I feel like like day one week one kind of thing because a lot of people are going to be playing it like those roads should still be built regardless anyway um you know because obviously obviously a lot of people are playing it but uh director squad has a highway in the mountains um i think that had it anyway um i remember there being a highway that obviously you've got the main road like i said that goes from the north to the south 
I'm fairly sure or from the south to the north, I think, or whichever way that is. The main road, you know what I'm talking about. But then the way, you know, where you're supposed to go up and around into the mountains, I'm fairly certain there was a highway going up that way anyway. It wasn't built. It wasn't built, and I didn't build it because I think the um, resources were fairly low. And I wasn't going to care to grind for who knows how long to build it for myself. Um, not when I could just... Um, I think some people had the zip lines going from the mountain. Or um, the cannon maybe or whatever it was. Um, I don't remember how I exactly I got down. But I'm fairly certain someone built a bloody zip line from where I needed to be to where I needed to go. And I just got on and I went straight down. Again... <laughs> See, this is the entire problem for me in Death Stranding, is looking back at it, I feel like the game is very handholdy in terms of if the community does stuff to help each other, then the game only gets extremely easy, right? Thus, the challenge and I guess the fun of the game is kind of negated because... Well, like I say, I can just tr I can just try make all my parcels go from A to B by just going along the road, or going um, up a cannon, down a cannon using the um, special trade system things um, to keep my stuff intact. If I know, say, I'm going to die or something, I don't need to use them anymore. You know, it's. Um... You're probably right. Yeah. So. I to avoid like I say, I don't think I would play two. Not when it comes out anyway, because especially Sony will be fucking 70 quid and I'm not paying that. But, um, again, some, some, sometime down the line when it's more like 30, 40, um, I'll consider it. If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the Civil War or done anything about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septum. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? Only if you don't know how to use it. All the great heroes have had to learn. Oh, yeah, I'll like, so definitely be something that I'll just shrank from their into death. later. Obviously, I have no idea what the hell happened at the Game Awards last night because I don't fucking watch that shit. <laughs> I've got better things to do in my life than to watch. Oh my god, it's a trailer for a game that's coming out in seven years. Or, um, Jeff just sucking off every goddamn studio because they just basically go. And then he goes. Although, I think, didn't fucking, um, if I, if I read this this morning, didn't like Al Pacino turn up or something? the game awards like why the fuck was he there well i understand fucking kratos being there because i think he won best performance or whatever which is ironic because i think at some point in his career he may or may not have said something again if what i read was true i take everything i read on the internet within reason with a grain of salt but i think at some point during his career years ago he said if you're acting in video games or whatever then your career's what like through the fucking floor or whatever and look at here, here he is, winning best performance in a video game. It's ironic how things turn out, isn't it? The only award he could ever win is one that is for a game that... I mean, let's be... Let's be I mean, I don't even know what the um, other performances were. What was it? It was God of War. I think... Um, I think there were two shitty... Um, can I? I can't flash travel on here, can I? <gasps> I can. Yeah, um, I think there were two shitty point-and-click adventure games that I don't care for. Um, but yeah. Again, but like I said, I don't give a shit. Game of the Year awards never fucking matter to me. Because again, Elden Ring isn't my game of the year. All, all, it, all it is is that someone paid more money than other companies to win. Your training proceeds well, Dragonborn. Where did you learn of that? <laughs> Who have you been talking to? The Blades, of course. 
They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the Blades to be used for their own purposes? What I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. No, not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. Oh, Dragonborn, wait. Uh, forgive me, I was intemperate. I allowed my emotion. The decision whether or not to help you. No, I cannot teach it to you. It is called Dragonrend. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons. When you learn a shout, you take it. In order to learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. Only Parthenax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so choose. He is our leader. He surpasses us all. You weren't ready, but... Thanks to the Blades, you now have questions. He lives in seclusion. He speaks to us only rarely, and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him, only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open And also the, um... Minecraft! Yay, Minecraft! Um... Pickaxe is up there somewhere. I do not remember where, but I'll see if I can find it. But then again, obviously, Tom bloody reminded me, so... Um, yeah. Yeah, probably just climb on that one. We'll show you how to open the way. Chrome. Lock. Close enough. Teach me my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. Is the sort of the will. Clear skies will blow away the mist, but only for a time. The path to Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. Now to talk to... It's a me, Parthenax. Woohoo! Oh. 
Shoot him in his bum. Ooh, right in his bum. Miles. I'm gonna save you. It's too cold up here. Drem your lock. Greetings, Wundernik. I am Parthenax. Who are you? What brings you to my Strumach, my mountain? They see me as master, Wuth Onik, old and wise. It is true I am old. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you entr- hmm. Drem, patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my thumb, feel it in your bones, match it if you are Dova King. That's not a cow, that's Mario. Yes, by the way, that is. That that is Mario. Ah, yes. Sausage. 
It's me, Paul Phoenix. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. No, oh, come back here. Come back, Mario. Don't bonk me on me head. So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. What you fucking call me? Even for one of Dova's source, dragon blood. What would you ask of me? Do you really want to come out? Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. Thank you. I'm losing for the year of 44 months. Did I say 30, 44? Whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm losing my mind. I wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. Yeah, thank you for the 44 months. I appreciate it, as always. You're an infinitely better fan than Daniel is, so um, you will always be number one. Alduin Comet Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovahkiin return together. I do not know the thumes. Oh, I mean, let's be perfectly honest. It's just because you subbed here since day one. To me. And admittedly, after all the times I've told you to go fuck yourself, and Daniel, he's the only one who stopped uh, something, so clearly he doesn't care. Let's just, me and you, let's just guilt him into um, doing it. I know, I know you'll fucking turn up and he would just be like, what? I'm eating me chicken, what are you talking about? Concepts. Or it would just be, excuse me. Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this thum? Prusa has good a reason as any. There are many who feel as you do, although not all. Some would say that all things must end, so that the next can come to pass. Perhaps this world is simply the egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin? Would you stop the next world from being born? Pause. A fair answer. Rofus, maybe you only balance the forces that work to quicken the end of this world. Even we who ride the currents of time cannot see past time's end. Wulsetid los trahodis. Okay, maybe it is best that Mario doesn't ever talk in his games because this guy just goes on and on. Those who work to like, can you just imagine Mary jumping on top of a Goomba and he has like a fucking 10 hour monologue? But the Goomba's dying. My weakness for speech long enough. You'd be sitting there like, Now I will answer your question. What question? Mm. Do you know why I live here? I missed out on your uh, colorful commentary despite the awards going as predicted. Yeah, no, I saw your message uh, this morning when I woke up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think it was a little too late by the time I woke up this morning at like fucking 10 o'clock, I will admit. Because uh, I kind of just passed out last night. <laughs> um, obviously, I did the whole message hi thing, and then you was like that, and then, like I said, I woke up this morning, and you asked what for um, me to see if um, I can listen in without being logged in, but yeah, like I said, I was passed out. <laughs> so, unless you want me to go back in time... Which is conveniently... No, we don't... Do you go... Yes, I I, um, I guess you kind of go back in time in this game at some point. <laughs> so yeah, unless you want me to learn the um, dragon word for time. 
This is the most sacred mountain in Skyrim, Zokravak Struma, the great mountain of the world. Here, the ancient tongues, the first mortal masters of the voice, brought Alduin to battle and defeated him. No sleepy boy. Mm, yes and no. Yeah, like I say, I, I just um. Well, I, I couldn't go to bed at all last night, and then yeah, he was passed out. So yeah, and I recorded some call later. Then. I mean, listen, would would I have listened to you talk about the game awards? I mean, listen, you would have probably said the same things I would have. So potentially. But at the same time, probably not, just because I could not give a single rat's ass about the game awards. Like, people win, Jeff gets bent over for like the seventh year in a row, however long this has been going on for. And every year it's always, oh, a game that I didn't vote for, but... Huh. Oh, you want an Elder Scroll? Yeah, about that. You mean this thing in my pocket? In your tongue. The dove have words for such things that jaw do not. It is an artifact from outside time. It does not exist, but it has always existed. Rahwalan. They are the Kelly. Elder Scrolls, as you name them, they have often been used for prophecy. But this is only a small... Mm, not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ, time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. I was having a shining too, and I there wasn't much to say outside of snarky comments on the whole thing. Yeah, I mean, um, didn't, I mean, you can answer me this, because like I say, I only, because I browsed Reddit for like five minutes this morning. Um, didn't like Al Pacino or something turn up? If so, why? Like, didn't he just turn up just to go? Game, I'm really old, I don't know what these are, but game. Or was, or is he like in some actual... If you thing. brought that I think it was Al Pacino that, that I saw, but yes, okay, so why the, why the fuck was why the fuck was he there? The time wound with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. Mm. Elder knowledge, complete elder knowledge. Ark Mora. Yeah, yeah, completed elder knowledge. He showed up uh, to give the performance award and to go herp herp, I'm old. So he turned up for no reason. Is basically what you're saying. But yeah, I, I did a quest in record time. Learn the location of the Elder Scroll and I pull it out of my pocket. Oh, you mean this thing? Because I did it earlier when I was doing the... Um... I'm gonna fall off doing this. Yeah, 
but seriously, they got him to basically just go herp herp. Here's an award, herp herp. Why? See, this, this is exactly why I don't care for the fucking game awards, man. It's always pompous and fucking up itself, and it's like, no. It's a fucking video game, mate. Calm down. You know, un un unless Al Pacino um, turned up, pulled out Modern Warfare 2, and started three, th um, 360 no scoping all the noobs, then I'd be like, oh, okay. But when I see, like, a fucking 100 year old man, or however old he is, I'm like, yeah, no. Malachite ore, where there it is. The notched pickaxe. Do you get it? Next to... I found the notched pickaxe. Raises the wielder's smithing abilities and does five shock damage to enemies on hit. like no games were announced then i mean i know um star wars was but today alduin's lordship will be restored but i honor your courage kreef wolf akrin die now in vain If you will, but maybe one you might be interested in. Tales of Arise 2. Glorious day, is it not? Have you no thought beyond the flooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? The battle below goes ill. If Aldun does not rise to our challenge, I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why does Alduin hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours, old man. You will come. come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade and almost. But none have yet stood against Alduin himself. Both Sori, Birka. They did not have Dragon Red. Once we bring him down, I promise. I will have his head. You do not understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. I mean when I slay him later. I brought the Elder Scroll. Well then, we agreed not to use it. I never agreed. And if you are right, I no. will not need it. We will it. deal with Alduin ourselves. Hear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. So be it.
real quick. Spirits have mercy on our souls. Unlooking, Akim, still is sure. My belly is full of the souls of your fellow mortals, Dovakim. Die now. And await your fate in Southern Guard. Lost foot, you are too late, Alduin. Dovakin, use Dragon Rend. Shouts. Dragoon Rend. You know it. I whiffed. Now I'm gonna wait like 10 minutes. I mean, when he's flying around and I can't fucking hit the damn guy. Yep, shut up. I am using Dragon Run Root. Uh, give me a moment. Got him. Four wins, boy of war got six awards in your quickest for Drew's performance win. Let's fucking hit him whilst I can. Thank <laughs> you. 
is Mulk of a king. You have become strong. Or enemies the bane of any existence. I mean, they are Durgans, but... I am Alduin, firstborn of the Akash, Malami Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you or anyone else. You cannot prevail against me. I will outlast you. Where the fuck did season on ending go? Walk to me, you fuck. Lot Kongrach. You truly have the voice of a... Yes. One of his allies. Perhaps the Hafkasayun, the palace in Whiterun. A fine place to trap one of Alduin. Hmm. Yes. But your Soom is strong. I do not doubt... Hmm. I have taught... But no, Dovaki. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the word, knowing a word of, contemplate the meaning of a rot. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Am I going to be fee fi fo from And yo. Not even remotely what I fucking clicked on. It is called force in your think of the way that is foos. Let it which calls to you fade pon that is fine. Let that mean which calls to you in your that is the tr think of this as the f yes. I used to visit him from time. I do not know. The Hofkossayun has been known as Dragon's Reach ever since. Um, excuse me, y'all of White Run. Can we, uh, like, capture a dragon, please? May the gods what? Uh, I must have misheard you. Of course. You already saved White Run from that dragon, but I don't understand. Why let a dragon. All do it. The world eater himself. But how can we fight him? Doesn't his return? 
I don't know about such things. Now what's this nonsense about then? White Run will stand with you, Dragon. So what's the plan now? How do you intend? To... Oh, well, probably. For... How do we do this? We will capture that motherfucker. Oh, you have no idea how we're doing this, do you? You came all the way here and you don't even have a fucking plan, do you? You absolute twat. You come all the way here asking me to do something extremely dangerous against my city and you don't even have a king plan, you felon. Learn shout to call Udaving. Hmm. Yeah. I have tasted the voices of Alduin's allies on the wind. There is one who I remember well. Odavin. He is the one to tell us. Ah. I forget how little you know of the Dove. You see, Pa Thurnax, a Thum, a Shab. He is not compelled to come, but the Dove are prideful by nature. But Odavin, he is. He will not resist. Now, hear his name, Odavin. Taste it on the wind. Oh, Darwin, know it in your soul. Oh, Darwin. Snow, Call Dragon. So his name is Snow Hunter Venus? Snow Hunter Wing. That is the name of the dragon in English. Cool. Um, right, I know what I was doing. I wanted to make some. Um, Dragon bones, because I need to fire, fire wood. I need one lot of fire wood. That should hopefully give me more than enough. I've been looking for you. I have a letter here from Quintus Navale in Windhelm. A letter? Not sure. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Oh. Hello. Oh, I just need one of these. And then... <laughs> How many arrows do I have? I have 75. I mean, I'll have what, about 200 something? Inventory weapons, 219. That should easily carry me to the end of the game. Get in your chair. Thank you. We're ready, Dreg. As I promised. My men stand ready. The great 
My men know what to do. Make sure you do your shouts. Cold dragon, snow hunter wing. I'm putting my city in your hands. That guy is going to get fucked. An apt phrase. Alduin Boval. I'm greeting you to my TV. I came to your call was to test your thumb for myself. Many of us have begun to question Alduin's lordship, whether his thumb was truly the strongest. Among ourselves, of course, Muni Mae, none were yet ready to. Once Lord Croesus. He has traveled to Sovngarde to regain his strength. The, his door to Sovngarde is at Skaldafin, one of his ancient fanes high. This angle makes a face no interesting. Oh, this angle. I surely do not need to warn you that all his remaining strength, the Ulost of an Hinlan. Now that I have um serve you? No. Hmm, Croesus. There is one detail. Only this. You have the Thurm of Adova. Of course. I could fly you there, but not while in prison. Only Khan Korav Gain Mirad. And you can trust me. Zu need. Free me, and I will carry you to Skaldafin. Yeah, there he is. Hello. How does he even see me anyway, considering his eyes are the... Now I'm down here. Hello. Ugh. It seems our en the world eaters eerie. Eerie. Have no end of spies, saboteurs, and assassins to send against us. I can't believe you sure about that. You want to let that your funeral? Someone else is gonna have to help you get him back in there again. Nah, you'll be fine. Oh, 
Yeah, I can ride Durgan. Also, he's saying that only a dragon can fly to the... Oh, I was gonna say, I thought the game broke. This is... I mean, you put me here. I could fucking jump up here, mate. Yeah, maybe not, but still. Yeah. Excuse me. You're all really bad at this. Hello. I think they were saying something along the lines of I won't make it to Skulldorfen. I'm gonna maybe run through this because I want to try and conserve as many arrows as possible. Because I'm probably gonna run out if I run through here. Snack. Herb.
very obvious. Oh. Yes, it is very obvious. I see them again. Burn Dragon. Oh, duh. Baby Rage. Yes, Baby Rage indeed. Because I don't care about their food sword now. You want a food sword down me?
That's a food store though. Flinging someone off a cliff. I mean, you don't want to turn around. Turn back, traveler. Terror waits with many have braved the shadowed veil, but vain is near Giant's Gap. In the gloom before dawn, we marched. Up. Then we stood and fought, our shield wall defending. But I never knew if night's end brought victory. I, Alduin, his hunger insatiable. Can you lead the way to where Shore's Hall waits? Ba I saw it fair when first I trod this long so Shore's Hall. I hurry before Alduin your life devours. Bring word to Shore. I'll try to hold to your hopeful purpose. Quickly before this encompasses the world leader's death. Thank you, Alduin. Wander here in Savangar, soul's end. A faithful errand. No few have chafed to face the worm since first he set his soul snare here at Savangar's threshold. But sure restrained our wrathful onslaught. Perhaps deep counseled. No shade are you, as usually. By what right do you request entry? Ah, it's been too long since last I faced a living or dead. By decree of shore, none may pass this perilous bridge. I judge them worthy by the warrior's test. Shores, you fought well. Since you can land by well. The shore's favor followed. I will fight you until I see you are worthy three hours later. You are worthy. Oh. 
the whole of the lawn. People! Far you've traveled, your trials. Seek ye food or taste song of Shovin Guard's sweet. Jurgen Wingcaller. Fate Welcome, Dragon Bard. You follow. Our door has stood empty since Alduin first set his soul snare on the By Shaw's command, we sheathed up. But three await your word. Gormleth, the fearless, glad hearted in battle. Hecka, well, this is the horn of Jurgen Wingcaller. Follow your own path. Fell this wisely. By Shores command, we Why does Shore forbid us to face up? Shore's power protects this hall. You freed's fucked old king of life. A fool of a poet, but an honest enemy who has earned my respect. Sadly, he's now lost in the soul snaring mist. Defeat Alduin and his doom averted. I hope to greet him in this hall as a friend. Seek ye food or song an ending? At long last, Alduin's doom is now ours. Speak the word, and with high hearts, you'll hasten forth to smite the worm wherever Alduin escape. All comrades. Let us counsel take before battle is blindly joined. Alduin's mist is more than a snare. Its shadowy gloom is his shield and cloak. But with four voices joined, our valor combined, we can blast the mist and bring him to battle. Feldir speaks wisdom. The world eater, coward, fears you, Dragonborn. We must drive away his mist, shouting together. And then on no, no, no. desperate battle with Fuck you, Halloween. Take that into your shitty dragon tongue. Dragon Slayer. Says the final boss. And then we are done. Uh, the mist, which means I need to get. Please, guys, we go. Gormleth Golden Hill. Is that because she's blonde? Even though I hilt at the butt. Oh. 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 So let me pull out my dragon bow. Also, do you guys like my armor? Now comes the dumb part. If I don't fucking time this, I think I'm gonna wait. So. No. Combine our shouts. Alduin will hide in this lightless mist until we shout together and shatter his power. Look! Oh no, man, I just do it. Dragon Rend. Come here, you bitch. Find me. Oh, don't you fucking cunt.
We win. Can I, can I loot you? I can't loot you. I want to loot you. I know you're going to go boom, but... Is that it? Yep. That's the final boss. <laughs> Me just. And then I win. This was a mighty deed. The doom of Gigi. Game over. Move on. Next game. It only took me 60 hours. They will sing of this battle in Shores Hall forever. But when you have completed your count of days, I may welcome you again with glad friendship. When you are ready to rejoin the living, just bid me so. Tarry not too long. The land of the dead is not meant for mortals to hail him with great praise. praise. Well, you've got a longbow, you've got nothing, you've got nothing. Hello. Our ancient debt for Alduin's reprieve is now repaid. When you are ready to rejoin the living, return now to me. With this rich boon from shore, my lord. A shout to bring a hero from Sovngarde in your hour of need. Yeah, you can bring one of those three. I think it's random which one you call, but... GG! Game over. Move on. Next game. Oh. These are the dragons that were lucky I didn't murder. I agree. 100%. Oh, by the way, that dragon there is voiced by Mario. That Mario. I'm still gonna murder you guys, by the way. It's like my job. Also, I stand here wearing the bones of their kin. It is done. Alduin Dilong. The eldest is no more. He who came happy. No, I am not happy. Zehmahi lost Ondul Bormahu. Alduin was once the crown of our father Akatosh's creation. You did what was necessary. Alduin had flown far from the path of right action in his Pachlok, in the arrogance of his Yeah, power. that's Mario. Who's talking right now? But I cannot celebrate his fall. Zultiraz Ach Ochma. He was my brother once. This world will never be the same. Perhaps. And... As you told me once, the next world was I forget myself. Croesus, Solos Midfadon, Melancholy is an easy trap for a Dover to fall into. You have won a mighty victory, Sahroch Kondra. One that will echo through all the ages of this world for those who have eyes to see. Savor your triumph, Dovakin. This is not the last of what you will write upon the currents of time. Because of the DLC. I feel younger than I am. Bye, Mario.
but willing or no, they will hear it. Fare thee well, Dovaki. GG. Good game, good game, good game. GG. What are you doing here? Who's a Wundana Wawuthka? If Alduin himself could not stand against your thew. As for myself, you've proven your mastery twice over. Thu Zu Odaving. Call me when. Bye, Odaving. Even though I literally just met you, but whatever. So yeah, I guess I'm just gonna go home. I will take my notched pickaxe with me. I shall put it on the wall. And I'm done. Like I said, I'm not gonna do the DLC just yet. I can't be asked. Oh, no, I'm not done. I'm an idiot. There's one thing I need to do. There's one thing left I haven't done. Which I need to make a save for. Um... First of all, weapons, my notched pickaxe. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Sadly, it's not a diamond pickaxe, but whatever. Um, I need to save. No, I know what I do want to do. Yeah, let's see, I haven't even finished the bloody Thieves Guild. Those are the last thing to do on my bloody list. Oh, and become Thane of Fuckface over here, then I'm done. My notes. Um, so yeah, the blades don't count because they're not really a thing. <laughs> I'll see if I can talk to this bell end who is ever in charge. Oh, they're still here. Don't even think about it. Think about what? I'm only teabagging them, mate. I don't like talking to some. Splendid. There's a house available. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. Travel safe. It's dangerous out there. What time is it? It's 12 or 1 a.m. and the king isn't even here. Is. In honor of your service in battle, I am hereby granting you permission. There is room in my court for a new fame. It's a... However, I could only... You help my people, and the honor will be mine. No. Sage, may the god, then by my right as Yar, I grant you a per... I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Well, that wasn't very hard now, was it? <laughs> mm -hmm. That wasn't very hard. That's fame of every bloody hold. Now it is just the Thieves Guild, and like I said, I didn't do the Thieves Guild because I wanted to keep my um, lockpick. Which, like I said, I'm going to make a save for before I hand it in. So I can reload that save before this if I can't steal it back and keep it. Can I help you? Also, I've probably got enough money to renovate every house in this game. Gain access to Hurim. Look for clues? What is this? Fucking... Oh, this is Harem. This was for the uh, murder, but... Like, R R Rangi, what do you want me to do? Are you the butcher? Did you do it, huh?
Yes. Which way, which way round is that mask facing? Oh, it's a weird optical illusion. Since it looks like it's obviously facing out when it's not. to you, my thane. Good day. No, I'm not even doing that right now. I am doing... Uh, wolf. Into the Twilight Sepulchre. Before I do that, I want to do this. I want to go into Ragged Flame. I guess make the save here. And then I guess just make this save. When I'm done. To the Twilight Sepulchre. Which is somewhere. I know the vampire one partially blows just because, you know, fighting vampires all the time, chance of run capture. I mean, I am actually kind of surprised that I didn't even get vampirism in this entire like 60 hour fucking playthrough. The amount of times that I ran into sudden vampires, a bit minimum, I maybe should have gotten it once, but I guess maybe having the dragon shit. Just killing them before they have a chance. I don't recognize you. The last of the Nightingale Sentinels, I'm afraid. I've defended the Sepulchre alone for what seems like an eternity. We were betrayed by one of our own kind. In fact, I was blinded. 
blinded by oh, your um, masquerading as friendship. No, no. Perhaps if I had been more vigilant, then Mercer Frey wouldn't have lured me to my fate and stolen the skeleton key. I haven't heard that name in a long How do you know of me? The key! You have the skeleton key! And Mercer Frey? Then, I owe you a great deal, Nightingale. You've done the guild a great deal. And my only regret is that you had to undertake... Carlyle? I feared she'd befallen the same fate, ending up a victim. Nothing would bring me more pride. From the moment I arrived here, I felt myself... The sepulcher isn't merely a temple or a vault to house the key. Within these walls is the Ebonair, a conduit to Nocturnal's... When Mercer stole the key, that conduit closed, severely limiting our time. I'm afraid so. I'm weakening, and I can... Whatever damage has been caused can only be corrected by following the Pilgrim's path to the Ebonair and replacing the key. Good luck. Night and day. I'll be fine. from the dead but I can certainly kill it I really I really fucking hate it when that happens man you fire a shot for all intents and purposes but they just like warp to one side it's extremely aggravating I'll stay in the shadows, idiot. I mean, I would have gathered that, but the game kind of fucking killed me because I wanted to search the bandit. Now why would Anders be down here? 
Yeah, there's gonna be a stone thing to pull. Books and this message. I can't believe it. I came all this way, so all this ridiculous riddles just went up here after I memorized Nistrum's clues he'd collected from Littlest. I slid his story, now I guess the joke's on me. I don't see why I hope someone comes by soon. I'm getting hangry. Yeah, there's gonna be a. Um... Very specific thing to pull, probably. Oh. I have the key, so it just does thing. Hello, Nocturnal. Someone who's now walking around with a semi, why? Or perhaps it's been moments one tends to lose track. So, once again, the key has been stolen, and a champion returns it to the sepulchre. Now that the Ebonmere has been restored, you stand before me awaiting your action. Yes. yes, please. What you failed to realize is your actions were expected and represent nothing more than the fulfillment of your agreement. I mean, not even, not even a reach around? Come on. Mistake my tone for displeasure. After all, you've obediently performed your duties to the letter. But we both know this has little to do with honor and oaths and loyalty. It's about the reward, the prize. Fear not. You'll have your trinkets, your desire for power, your hunger for wealth. I bid you to drink deeply from the ep What am I doing? Darkness returns. Oh, yeah, this is just... For this is where the agent of Nocturnal is born. <laughs> the oath has been struck, the die has been cast, and your fate awaits you in the Everglow. Oh, hey, Carlo. I'm glad you were able to bring the key back safely. Nocturnal seemed quite pleased with Finishing that. yesterday. No. I'm glad you were able to bring the key back safely. Nocturnal seemed quite pleased with your efforts. I wouldn't take that to heart. Think of her as a scolding mother continually pushing you harder to be successful. I assure you, had she been displeased with you, we wouldn't be having this conversation. The circles at the base of the Ebonmere imbue you with power. The crescent moon represents the agent of shadow, the half moon for the agent of subterfuge, and the full moon for the agent of strife. This is Nocturnal's way of... If you ever feel the need to change your abilities, be warned that once you've chosen, you can't resub now. Your life. Then I said I was finishing yesterday. No, I said that I was gonna, probably going to be finishing today. Well, I mean, yesterday I was probably saying like, oh, I'm finishing this quest here. I'll finish this quest there. But yeah, no, I finished it now. This was pretty much the last quest I needed to do, so I'm done. My life has finally been filled. I only hope that this isn't an ending to things. Why, perhaps the greatest crime spree Skyrim's ever. There are pockets brimming with coin, and co we may be nightingales, but in our hearts we're still thieves. The agent of subterfuge. By weaving the darkness to their will, this agent can manipulate others into fighting for the night. The agent of stealth is the master of room. On moonlit nights or in darkened rooms, this agent literally be This agent of strife can send forth a tendril at the same time. This tether will bolster the agent's own life force, making him stronger. Oh well. Eyes open, and walk with the shadows. Gallus! I feared I would oh, yeah. well, well, once I'm done here, I'll uh, boot up. Some titty two for an hour, may as well. 
Your fears would the perfect amount of time to play. He honors us all. Kind of. What will you do now, my love? Oh. <gasps> calls me to the Everglow. My contract has been fulfilled. Will I ever see you again? When your debt to Nocturnal has been paid, we'll embrace once again. Farewell, Gallus. Eyes open. Walk with the ship. Did he too? Yes, did he too. Goodbye, whoever you were. What are your nature effects? Yes, Nightingale. What is it? Gallus's oath has been bad. Now his spirit becomes one with the Everglow. The realm of perpetual... No. This is the greatest honor a Nightingale can possibly achieve. Indeed. Absolutely. When we say, walk with the shadows... You like most pale and mass maybe some of them get added permanently. It's believed that... Um, as non-Christmassy versions? Well, here's the thing. That's why the Ebonmere needed to be reopened. With all these fucking updates, I, I really don't understand why they don't have them permanent, permanently anyway. You know, like, just having the non-themed versions, and then just having the themed versions, and then obviously at the top of a list, Halloween, Christmas, if you wanted to do a fucking Valentine's Day one, whatever. <laughs> You know, then having that say at the top, but then even if you say did go into say payload, um, control point, whatever, if you play said map, it plays the um, themed version. You know, all versions are the themed versions. But I mean, hey. If this place is in danger, should the need arise, a portal connects the Sepulchre and Nightingale Hall. Use it whenever you wish. Oh, so I don't need to go back through the... Uh, so what is under new management? Because then this should be the last one. Yeah, like I said, I'm not going to be on it too long, but... <laughs> Like I said, I've done everything else, so... Hmm? Been doing a few jobs for Max. How about you? I just wanted to give you a prop. The guild is back on its feet. What's become of the skeleton key? That's it then. After all, but enough of that. I'm confident that with you and... I'll be down here. Trying to coordinate. If you still feel like doing some job, either way, it's been a pleasure, my friend. Here's to the future of the guild. May it last another thousand years. Well, my friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guild master. Don't worry. I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of this cistern room, we can begin. No. Oh. Why is everyone surrounding me? My sword. Hello. Do you mind? Bring your- get your fucking ass over here, man. good at these things so I'm just gonna keep it short being guild master means more than just getting a it's about being a leader keeping this rabble in order 
with that in mind, I propose that the position of guild. We're in the middle of a goddamn ceremony. That message is like. Delvin. Agreed. Thanks. Sure. Why not? Carlia. Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you guildmaster. I wish you good fortune and long life. Now everyone, get back to work. I you need you anything? It. Anything at all? Well, that's it. Sorry if it is. After we're done, head up. Oh, and one last thing. Here, I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. Amulet of articulation. Persuade checks and dialogue will almost always succeed in speechcraft is 20% better. Anything at all. I can't think of a better person for the job, Nightingale. Thank you. Ooh, a flawless ruby and some money. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Do you need anything? Anything at all? to a long and yes and i mean look at this place i've never here you go should fit you like a glove boss i'm one with the shadows guild masters crap carrying capacity by 50 nice pickpocket 35 lock picking 35 prices 20 percent i like money what do you think okay, okay, okay. do you like how much money i've got i've got 58k I mean, I would, I did, I did have seventy or somewhere along that because obviously I bought the bloody house for twelve k. Could a beautiful woman like you ever see yourself with an old codger like me? Absolutely. Oh really? Well then. Who are you talking to? When you're in your grave, and I'm standing over it. Now get out of my way. Oh, she's you. He was talking to her about love. I'm going to make a quick save because I want them to change my appearance because I want my trophy. Change it. I do not practice my art. Very well. tell me what you desire. Sweet beauty or hideous trophies. Arrive on Solstheim. I mean, I should have that, but... Escape from jail, I can do. Get married, that's a whole thing. Bounty of a thousand gold, whatever. Have a hundred thousand gold. Um, I could just sell all my shit for that, probably. Um, learn 20 shouts, try and done. Reach level 50. Neither here nor there. Uh, awakening beyond death, kindred, lost to the ages. Learn all three words of a soul tier, that's DLC. Aurel's bows, probably DLC. Werewolf perks and vampire perks, I want to say they're DLCs as well. Defeat a legendary dragon, that might be in a particular spot. Adopt a child, I can do that, that's not too hard. Build three houses, which I haven't done, I know how to. And arrive on Solstheim. Oh no, Solstheim is the DLC. <laughs> DLC, I'm fairly certain DLC, 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 I think DLC, 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 DLC. So a lot of these I can get, like escaping from jail is not hard, getting married. I uh, don't exactly know how to do that, but that shouldn't be too hard. Bounty for a thousand gold in all nine holds. I just go to place, shoot people in face, get a thousand gold. And then just do that in all the major cities and call it a day and reload. I have 100,000 gold. I mean, I do have 58. The easiest way is to repeat these Thieves Guild quests. That's the easiest way of doing it. Uh, learn 20 shouts. I mean, you just look up a list of where you find the unique ones and get them. Uh, level 50. I can kind of do that now. Um... And then I think all of these from onward, besides like adopting a child and being on... Actually, Defeating the Legendary Dragon might also be DLC. I'm fairly certain those two are DLC. 
Yeah, I'm fairly certain pretty much everything down. Yeah, I mean, adopting a child was DLC because that was a part of the house DLC, I think. I'm going to keep saying DLC, by the way. Yeah, I think that was a part of the house one. Um, so, yeah, probably everything below reach level 50. So, yeah. 62 hours, Jesus Christ. How many hours do I have in this? Fifty-seven hours it took for me to beat this, and I've still got two DLCs. Again, DLC. But I'm out. I'm not doing this. Not today, anyway. Maybe I'll come back sometime in the new year. I won't leave it too long to come back to this. Um, I'll give it a little bit of break. Like I say, I might do it sometime in the new year. But uh, I somewhat know what I'm going to be doing for the next game. I know, like, Daniel's asked for me to do... Um, this is Halloween, this is Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. Uh, but I don't remember if I've got it on Xbox or PS2. I'm fairly certain it's PS2 I've got it on. But is it under N? Uh, it's got to be under N, because Nightmare. Mm. Well, where is it? Yeah, whatever, it's over there somewhere, who knows. Yeah, anyway, I'm out. Um, in terms of YouTube anyway, that's the main game done. I will be back for the DLC at some point in a few weeks. But uh, until then, hope you enjoy. Ta-ta for now.